and welcome to the next episode. <laughs> uh, I'm continuing exactly where I left off. Today's my day off, so I'm just going nuts. I want to explore so much of this game today. I'm having a blast, and I hope you are too. I hope you're having a good time, and everything is going well. It certainly is for me. Let's see if we can get back up here. I wanted to traverse this gap. Because something tells... Whoa! Almost fell down. And something just... Is the sun about to explode? That was a big shadow overhead. Uh... Okay. Okay, that was easy. It seemed way harder than it was. Where do we go now? Oh wait, I get it now. The fragments I was reading on the ground is the bridge that collapsed. And it all fell down here. Yep. Obviously. But where did this come from? Was this just randomly on the bridge? Because that's a little weird. Let's go this way. Oh. Oh, God. Whew. Well, you need a shower sometimes, right? What do we have here? Is Oh, is this mining site 2A? I wonder. No, wait, they decided not to mine that because it would interfere with the local life. I'm pretty sure. Actually, it could be. Ooh. Nope. What am I doing? Mining side two. Oh wait, we were here. So the door is closed again. It is the same place, right? It's where I landed my ship. I came from up there. Down here. It's gotta be. Okay. Uh... Oh, this is the intended route that I'm going now. I sort of brute forced it by landing directly here. I see. I see. I see. Okay. Or I don't know if it's intended or not. It's just one way to get in. One way to get in. Now, I'm curious about this place because, like I said, there's always secrets with waterfalls. Now, can I make it from here? That's the question. I want to try. Worst case, I'm going to land in the water, right? So I'll be fine. <gasps> Oh shit, there we go. We're fine. Ah, that was actually pretty nice. Ghost matter? Yep. Let me uh, photo mode it. Oh god, that's ghost matter everywhere. Let's not go that way, let's go along the river. Into this very loud waterfall again. Secret behind waterfall? No? Oh god, I can't see anything. Jesus. Okay. I'm convinced there's a secret behind one of these waterfalls. There's gotta be. Like, what is this place now? There's gotta be something here, right? There's gotta be something here. Otherwise... Okay, I can't go this way. Actually, I don't know if I can. I don't know how much damage I'll take or if I just die instantly. Whoa. I'm gonna try and get up this way. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh shit. Thank god that was water. Okay, I think I've explored enough here. Let me go back. Oh, I could have just flown over the ghost matter. Why do I... Oh, let me go up there, actually. Whoa, just about. I realize I'm getting far away from my ship. Actually, I'm not. Only 200 meters? That's not too bad. I do want to explore this mountain. Am I going way too much off the beaten path here? Is the question. Oh, 
I mean... Okay. Now this looks interesting. There's gotta be something here. Secret? Yes? No. Oh my god, it's so disorienting being in there. Let me go this way. I'm using up a lot of fuel here. I need to be careful. Well, one more push. Urgh, get up there. Holy shit. Oh, wait, I'm such a dumbass. This is just the same exact place I was. This is where I uh, landed my ship, right? Let me just take a quick walk around here. See if I can uh, see something else. Okay, you know what? Let me go back to my ship. 300 meters. Also, the sun is about to explode, I think. It's pretty red and it's pretty giant. Pretty giant? Is that... Can you say that? Probably not. It is pretty. Oh, man. Whoa. Let's go like this. Let's go like this. Oh, yeah. What is that thing? No. That's not what I wanted. Oh, I know what I want to try. I want to try and launch a... A scout into it. It's gone. I love it so much. <laughs> I love it so much. I really do. I love the uh, coronal mass ejections they're displaying here on the sun. They happen when the magnetic field of the sun gets so intertwined and so complex that at some point they just... it bursts and a bunch of charged particles are streaming out from the sun. In real life, when they hit the Earth, they travel along the magnetic field lines of the Earth itself and funnel onto the poles where they generate northern lights. So I wonder if northern lights is something we can see in this game. Okay. So we explored this place. No clue what it is. Sure, we'll get the explanation at some point. Wait a minute. Yeah, that's what we were. Um, let's go this way. Smoke. Let's explore the smoke. Yeah, we haven't been here before. Let's touch down right in the center of this crater. Oh, that's a slope. That's a slope. That's a slope. Oof. <laughs> there we go. Good enough. Oh, I almost have no more fuel. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Refuel jetpack. Oh, there's someone here. What is this? I'm getting a... I'm stuttering. Tektite. Hey, yo, hatchling. Thought you were taking that tin can of yours into space today. What are you still doing here? Actually, I took it out many times already. Because I'm in a time loop. Me? I saw something crash over the horizon. I didn't like what I was seeing in the pictures of my little scout I was sending back. So I thought I'd come over here myself and take a look. Ooh, is it? So what crashed? I don't know what it is exactly. Looks like some kind of plant seed. But it's not a... And we're dying. But it's not anything I've seen on Tipper Hearth before. And trust me, I was quite the explorer back in the day. You think it's extraterrestrial? I can't focus on this while this stuff is happening in the background. We're dying. Ah, shit. I'm gonna come back for you. I'm gonna come back for you, brother. <laughs> Yeah, 
This is this is the mask they were wearing in that picture. It's really fun seeing uh, everything you did in reverse. Really puts it into perspective uh, the distance you've traveled and the things you've done. Okay, what is that thing? Definitely looks like... Ooh, it actually looks like... No. I have no clue what it looks like. Hmm. Another mystery for another day. So I want to go back to, uh, to that guy that we were just talking to. Suit up. Full fuel. And let's go. Equip scout launcher. Wait. Oh, that's amazing. I can through I can uh, launch scouts from my ship. I just noticed the the button prompt there. Wait, I should log on to this planet. There we go. Landing mode. And where was this guy again? Smoke. Look for smoke. Look for the smoke. What was that sound just now? There it is. I'm coming for you. What was your name? What is this sound? It's like a whooshing. Okay, let's do a much better landing this time. It's a slope. It's a bit sloped here, so it is what it is. That's okay. Um, alrighty. Look at all this ice. Kind of looks like a thorn. Hey, yo, hatchling. Thought you were taking that tin can when you were into space. Uh, yeah, you saw something crash, so... Uh, so what... Cra so is that a dark bramble seed? You think so? It's nothing I've ever seen on Timberhearth before, so you're probably onto something there. Whatever it is, it put down roots in a hurry. I don't like the look of this thing, Hatchling, and that's a fact. I think I'll set Marl and Hal loose on it. Best get rid of this mess sooner rather than later, and no one can remove an unwanted plant faster than a tree keeper can. Yeah. I'll have to get a look at what's inside the seed first, though. Don't want to set anybody to hacking up a potentially dangerous plant without a better idea of what's lurking inside there. Tuff can help me hold the old scout launcher over here. Obviously, the opening is too small for someone to fit inside. And anyway, I'm not going to blindly stick my hands into anything that looks as unpleasant as that seat does. That's a good way to lose an arm or two. If you say so. Scout launcher, huh? Let me try that. Fuck. It keeps going. Oh my god. What? Error duplicate signal. What? Duplicate signal. So... Okay. Uh, wait a minute. What the actual shit? Okay, there's definitely some alternate dimension shit going on here. Because that seat is way bigger. Inside. It may be a portal, actually, to somewhere. Which is kind of fucked up. 
And why is there a an anglerfish in here? What is that? Is that a campfire? There's trees. I mean, it probably is. This is such a mindfuck right now. Let me uh Notice how the yeah, look look at the distance. Also, I just noticed. Error duplicate signal. 28 kilometers? Can I see this on the map, I wonder? Can I see the signals here? Yes. Dark Bramble. Actually, looking at this, it looks exactly like this thing. We have like a hole here and a hole here. See? And a hole here is exactly like on the map. Wait a minute, let me show you. There's that moon. It wasn't there before. It's fucking with me. It's moving around. There's a hole here. Actually, I have a I have a I have an idea. <laughs> I fucking knew it. I get it now. I get it. It's the quantum moon. I mean, it is. And that's what the tutorial was teaching me. With the stone that was moving around? When I didn't look at it. This is the same, but it's a, it's a whole moon. Man, that's creepy. That's so cool. How cool is that? That's so creepy, man. But I love it. I really do. So weird. Now, I wonder, what if I throw in a scout on this side? Haha! Is it just the same? No. Yes. Okay. So it doesn't matter where I throw it. We fall into the mouth of an anglerfish. Huh. That's interesting. Uh, buddy, I think we got a problem here. Blasted Seed did a lot of damage when it crashed. I like this crater. Yeah, it makes sense. Seed. It's called Dark Bramble. It's all like organic and tree -y in a way. Like with roots, seeds, brambles, you know? Need something from you, hatchling? I threw a little scout into the seed. You did, did you? And you're telling me it's bigger on the inside than the outside? Hmm, this is gonna be a chore to chop up, and no mistake. Can we even remove a seed that doesn't have the decency to stay the same size all the way through? <laughs> You're not puzzled by this fact? Maybe I'd better grab an extra axe or three, just in case. How are you not puzzled by the fact that this is an alternate dimension we've got here? He's just like, ah, means more work for me. Uh, man, cool. Okay. So this is like a portal to Dark Bramble. Why is it here? Also, I noticed all the crist uh, all the ice crystals were also on the moon. But there's no seed on the moon. Unless I missed it. Dark Bramble seed. A seed from Dark Bramble crashed here and has already taken root. Tektite wants to use a scout launcher to get a look at what's inside. I launched my little scout into the seed. Somehow the seed is much bigger on the inside. Yes. Inside... Inside the seed. When I launch my scout into the seed that crashed on Timber Hearth, it ends up in a much bigger space filled with a fog and thorny vines. Yes. 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 Uh, I'm not gonna leave here just yet. I just wanna. 
It's a much easier way to tra uh, way to travel around in this ship. I just want to see if there's anything I could maybe do here. Oop! Don't crash into the trees now. Don't think there's. I mean, I really should get down on the ground and see it for myself. Mm, no. This may be it. Let's say this is it for now. Um, okay, these geysers I want to check out. I want to check out these geysers. They're not that big. Kind of small. Uh, let me land here. Beautiful. Get out there, you explorer, you. Oh. See something. No, it was just a trick of the eye. What? Is that water? It is water. Ah, I guess it makes sense. It's spewing out water everywhere, right? So there's pools. Can I go in here, though? Whoa, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Oh, God, here we go. Oh, shit. Okay, we're safe. We're in water. It's down here. Whoa! Okay. We're riding the current. To somewhere. Where are we? Let me light up this, this place. Okay, that's not much light. I'll take what I can get. Uh... Okay, I want to try this. Go into this. Whoa! <laughs> cool. Whoa, and back down. Ah, oh, don't touch it now. It's probably hot. So the water's flowing out there. It's flowing in here. I bet I can keep going there, but let me just check. Okay, I don't see anything here. Maybe this is just a pit stop. Here we go. Take me. Whoa. Whoa, what was that? What is that? Did you see that? Oh, we're here. Let me just read this again. Oh yeah, they, were, they didn't want to disturb the local life. Got it. Uh, what else can I do here? I can keep going. Let's do it. Whoa! Oh my god, it's getting darker. I can't see anything. Holy shit. Oh. I've got some things here. Let me light this up. Ah, get down there. Am I walking on the surface? I am. Whoa. Get down. I thought this was a, a refueling thing. What do we got? Man, hip flasks everywhere. I wonder if this is uh, if those hip flasks contain the moonshine that that one Harthian guy is making. It's cooking up right now on the surface. Okay, is there really nothing here? Wait, what is that? I see something. Something shiny. No, it was just a reflection. Okay, let's go up here. Barrels. And more trash. I wonder. Hmm. Can I really not do anything with this? That's kind of surprising to me. Okay. Uh. Can I keep going in the current? I don't see a way. No. I guess the only way out is... is up. 
Take me. I'm ready. Take me. Whoa! <laughs> Holy sh- Oh my god, we're going all the way up. Holy fuck. This may actually be a little dangerous. Let me... Oh. That went better than I expected. Oh, wait, we're here! Hey! You! Hi, astronaut! You know the patch of ghost matter inside this fence? Gosson said it used to be bigger when we were a hatchling. Because ghost matter evaporates. It takes a long time. You shouldn't be throwing rocks in there. Ghost matter is dangerous. Uh, obviously. That's what makes it so awesome. Jeez, I'm not dumb enough to touch it. Ugh, you're such a grown-up. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to sound like a grown-up. Fucking everything is exploding. We've got moons disappearing. Everything is in a, is in a state of chaos. Uh, and I... I have no... Like, I, I really wonder at this point... What the point of this game is? Like, what is the ending? How do I end this game? Like, is there... I mean, obviously there's a storyline somewhere that I'm picking up on here, but how is everything gonna come together? I'm so curious to find out. How is this game gonna progress? Oh, yes. Give me that music. Actually, while I'm here, I want to see if the guy in the observatory has anything new to tell me. So let me... Let me just take a leap of faith here. That was a fantastic launch I just did there. I'm very proud of myself. Ooh. This is new? I should have been here before. Hey, look at this. The statue opened its eyes. Bet you wish you'd seen that happen, huh? Huh. Me too. I'm not even a little closer to understanding what's going on with this statue. Was there something you needed? Hmm. Tell me more about Feldspar. Feldspar was one of the four founding members of Outer Wilds, along with our flight coach, Gossen, Slate the Engineer, and me. As ground control and later museum curator, I didn't work with Feldspar as closely as Slate and Gossen did. I can tell you Feldspar was absolutely fearless, fearless though. Nothing scared them. Test piloted everything Slate ever built. It's a wonder Feldspar lived to see space. Frankly, but they did. Flew all sorts of danger stunts and explored everything they could find. And then one day they just didn't come back. We don't know what happened or where or where Feldspar went, or even whether they're still alive. That's right. It's been a long time since they left. Uh, I'm good. I completely forgot about that. I wanted to explore where the harmonica signal came from on this planet, but I got distracted by other things. Where's my ship? Oh God, it's far away. God damn it. Uh, let me just, can I just find it? There. 200 meters. It's close. It's probably on the other side of the planet here. This direction. Let me grab my ship. First things first. What just happened with the music? It's like it skipped the beat. Let me go up here. Whoa. God damn you. Come on. Let's fl Oh, I see my shadow. Look. No? Yeah, it is my shadow. It's very hard to see. So, these rivers... They are intriguing to me because... The little symbol for this planet contains these rivers. I mean, maybe it's just... A way to distinguish them from other planets, but... Still. You know what I'm noticing here? 
So the stars are exploding, right? I'm pretty sure there are way less stars in the sky right now than in the beginning, because I distinctly remember looking at the sky thinking, holy shit, there's a lot of stars. I think that's what's happening. When this star is gone, there's not gonna be a point of light anymore. I just want to see this once and for all. Yeah, look. And it's gone. I wonder if our sun is the very large star to explode. And is this the condition that triggers it to explode when all the other stars are gone? I will try and pay attention to this now. So it may just be based on time, actually. The trigger condition for the star going supernova. Like, given enough time, it just happens. It's unavoidable. You can't really do anything about it. Why am I in a time loop? And nobody else from the village. Because when I talk to them, they don't seem to know what the hell I'm talking about. So... That's a bit of a mystery. So I am so curious to go exploring somewhere else in the solar system right now. I'm sure there's more on this planet to explore. But... I kind of just want to go somewhere else. Whoa, let's not go too crazy here. I just wanted to look at the map. Oh my god, the sun is huge. It's about to explode. I want to go... I think I want to go to the Hourglass Twins. I want to explore this whole thing about the Ash Twin project. Hmm. Where's this line between them? I remember to see, uh, I see, I saw a line, a rod between them last time that I don't see anymore. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go to, yeah, I think I'm gonna go here. Actually, let me try something. Can I lock on from here? I think I can, right? I'm gonna go to Ash Twin. Oh shit! Okay, so the ship obviously still moves while I'm looking at the map. Ash Twin is this way. Oh shit, here we go. Ah, we're gonna die. Ah, fuck. Holy shit, that looks glorious. Ho 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 ho! I'm getting goosebumps. Actual goosebumps right now. Okay, fuck it. I'm flying straight into it. Take me. Take me! What a unique game. What an absolutely unique game. I don't think I've ever played anything like this. Like, not even close. And I've played a lot of games, let me tell you. Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna call it here, and I'll see you in the next episode. I can't wait to figure out what's happening on Ash Twin, and the Ash Twin Project. Until then, have a good one. Bye.